Hi guys, it's Wombat and today I'm finally, finally releasing the Black Sea DLC map combo Global Edition. And this one took quite a while to complete, not only because I have a new Asus ROG Strix GeForce RTX 2080 Ti 11 gigabytes OC gaming graphics card <sighs> that I spent a lot of time testing along with improved graphics for ETS2 and ATS, but also because I spent most of last week in working for a company I can't name and the Asus card that I already mentioned was the payment for that job. Uh, but I also ended up with a Buffalo Link Station Pro Quad LS QVL 12TB NAS they had scrapped. Not because, because it didn't work, but because it used SMB1 for file sharing and obviously I'm not going to use SMB1 either, which is why I created a fix to allow its Samba version to use SMB2 instead. It's a hack, it's not supported by Buffalo, but it works for me. A uh, company, on the other hand, doesn't use hacks like that. They scrap and buy new things instead, so they gave it to me and now I have a place to sh save the next two and a half thousand videos I will release. And then this is also my kids week, so basically it's almost impossible to record things since I don't have much personal time when my youngest daughter is here. And the little time I do have has been going into trying to get Ross and Promsona to at least kind of work with the new version of Rossmap 2.0 and Great Step for 136. Yes, the new version of Rossmap 2.0, because there are now three editions of Rossmap 2.0. It's the original one by Aldimator, and then there's the updated fixed version by Sergey, and the fixed version by Sergey also uses an add-on that recreates St. Petersburg into its former glory found on Sergei's older unofficial release version of Rossmap. And I'm sorry to say that Promsona won't connect to St. Petersburg with any of these three versions. Since earlier I knew that Ross wouldn't connect to Great Step for 136 either due to Great Step being partially moved. So as things stand right now we need at least a working Promsona or RC for Ross slash Great Step before I will add Ross to my map combos again. And even with one of those updates we will most probably have some broken roads on Ross because for this to be perfect Ross needs to be updated for Great Step as well. So to summarize, I can live with some broken roads, but I need at least one working road connection before I add Ross back to my map combos. And this is also why I have been reluctant to update my Pro Mods Global Edition, and honestly, I might redo this map combo using the old Ross map and Great Step versions, if a majority of the comments say that you need Ross for a true global combo. But if the majority is fine with a global combo without Ross, I will update my ProMods global combo the same way as I updated or created this one. It's entirely up to you what we should do with Ross and Ross map and Great Step as things stand right now. So what else do we have on the map today? We have CH map for starters. CH map is the official name for the map and add-on formerly known as Rock and PRC. It's been called CH map for more than a year now and it's time we start using the name too because now that PRC no longer is an add-on for Rock, the two mods have been combined. It's just going to be confusing to continue calling it Rock because people wonder where PRC is and then they see that they have both Rock and PRC and they wonder why I didn't say so and although PRC is just an add-on for rock, both people from from the countries of PRC and ROC gets mad at me when I call the map ROC regardless of where I haul. So from now on it's CH map and I feel free to refer to it as either a Taiwan map or a map of China regardless of where on it I haul. I could do an entire video on this map and its history and even why they chose the name CH. but. That will probably bore you to death, so I feel I've already said more than enough about it. 
We have YKS, RSK and PJ Indo too, but more interestingly, we don't have Antarctica map. It needs to be updated. Smelly Pango has said that he is working on it. And I wish it was ready, but it isn't, so we wait. I also wanted to use Vane map, but the update that should have been released this month has been delayed until February or March. So I will use Vane map once it's released, though, since the biggest complaint was that the trafficking company mod included was quite intrusive. I can inform you that Jonathan has told me that the update will separate the traffic and company from the map mod, so we are able to choose if we want to use his traffic or not. Uh, but again, the map hasn't been updated, so we aren't using Vayner map today. But speaking of traffic, in this combo I've included a mod I made that removes the Chinese traffic completely, since that too is way too intrusive. I've also made a similar mod for Ross, because I'm sick and tired of these maps being criticized more for their traffic than for the actual map itself. So getting rid of the traffic allows both me and everyone else to focus on what is really important, the maps and how they should be expanded, developed and refined. Speaking of maps that needs further development, Australia is here. But this can't really continue. Either something is done with the quality of that map or I'm gonna remove it from future updates. There are just too many hidden walls and bugs on this map. And it's not more Australia than PJ Indo is Indonesia. It's just less attractive, although the forest roads are very interesting and well worth visiting. Just don't use road trains on those forest roads. Lastly, I was hoping to be able to add a surprise to the combo and that surprise would have been RBR. Arguably, RBR is a paid mod, but it works beautifully in combo with CH map. Unfortunately, it uses FLD assets shared with Roex and both maps requests exclusive access to said prefabs, according to our friend Warren. And so the game crashes when you load RBR and Rowex at the same time. It's at least to me an unusual situation and as always I do not fully understand it, but the point is RBR was going to be the surprise, surprise has been ruined, there is no RBR map on this combo. But that's enough talk, let's take a look at what the map looks like before we move on to how you set it up and then go through what problems you may encounter getting the mom combo to work and how you solve those problems. Let's get going! And here is the map. It's basically the same map that we had on the Europe edition, but with a couple of additions to that. We have CH map over here. Uh, we should have or could have had RBR map down here, uh, that would have covered this area here. Unfortunately, we can't use it, as I mentioned earlier. Uh, we have PJ Indo, which would be a ton larger if it was the Vayner map, but the Vayner map won't be available until February, March, so we'll have to wait for that. And uh, we, as I said earlier, we don't have uh, Antarctica. But we do have Australia down here. And if we move on, we find YKS RSK as well added to this combo. Other than that, we have the same mods that we had on the Europe edition, which includes both the Mediterranean map, the, um, let's see if we can find it. It's the Magdeburg is there, there it is. The test track version 2.0. We have North Map up here. And then we have Swedish Islands over here. We have Jur Map. We have the Poland Detail Adding mod over here. And let's not forget Paris Rebuilt this time. We also have Row X. 2.4 the DLC version, Rossmap 2.0 updated, 
and then we have the larger as you can see Weiborg and St. Petersburg so basically what you see here is the add-on for Rust map or the add-on for the updated Rust map this uh, the gray roads here is what that add uh, mod adds in uh, and oh let's not forget we also have the Rotterdam Brussels highway intersection over here and then we have Rasmus as I said we have the Great Step and the road to Aral and finally southern region and here are the active mods list from the bottom we have Australia Tasmania model map dev followed by PJ Indo then we have the CH map or ROC map whatever you want to call it I'm calling it CH map from now on we have this China map yeah <laughs> uh, and some new some changes to it on 136 is that it doesn't really matter anymore where you put the different mods it's much easier now the important thing is that you have the map file at the bottom and that you have the AI and mod def files on top ignore this one for now we have mod def here and AI def here and map mod map here and in between we have the rest of the CH files on top of that we have my mod which is the CH mod traffic fix and what my mod does is that it simply removes the Chinese traffic completely it's gone we don't have any of these crazy Buddha statues being hauled all over the world. We don't have Chinese trailers all over the world anymore. They are completely gone. Now we just have to focus on the map itself. So there's that. We also have the Australia Tasmania Death Quick Fix by Warren, version 4. Then we have Med Map version 0.1, Truck Test Area 2.0 north map 1.7 the great step model map def and road to aral we have southern region map model 3 2 1 and the dlc version of the def and map file so this is not the original southern region def and map file it's the dlc version so when you download southern region you get all these files here and then you download separately again the diff and map file but then in the dlc version instead we have southern region english city names and southern region map fix for 136 we have the updated version 2.0 of rust map so this is not the original version 2.0 this is the updated version of 2.0 by sergey sergey have fixed uh, several issues that was found with Rustmap 2.0 and you now only have to download one zip file to get all these four files here there are not uh, five or was it six can't remember different uh, files to download to download the entire Rustmap it's just one single file instead and when you have downloaded that single file you have model 2 model map and def on top of that Sergey has been kind enough to add back in again both the old St. Petersburg and Weiburg, Weiburg version from Rustmap 1.9.3. Wasn't that 1.9.5? Ah, never mind. It's back anyway. So we have a larger St. Petersburg and a larger Weiburg now, thanks to the Peter for Rustmap 2.0 file. Then we have city translation or English city names for Rustmap followed by the DLC version of Romania Extended 2.4 so if you buy Romania Extended 2.4 as a single purchase make sure that you purchase the DLC version for this combo if we are using pro mods you need the standard or regular 2.4 version but we aren't using pro mods here we are using the black sea dlc so for this combo you need the dlc version 
And if you have the DLC version, you add file number four, three, two, and one. Then we have the regular ROWX to ROSMAP road connection and the ROWX to Southern Region version two road connection. We also have the standard ROWX English city names and then we have YKS RSK version 2.0 DLC. So not your regular YKS RSK that you're familiar with from my Pro Mods map combos. This is the DLC version, which does not include any cities west of Istanbul or including Istanbul. That is the Black Sea DLC. Then east of Istanbul, it's the good old YKS RSK instead. So that is the DLC version. Make sure you use this one and not the regular one. Uh, but the YKS RSK to Southern Region Road Connection version 2 still works beautifully. We have Rotterdam to Brussels Highway uh, Road Intersection, Poland Detail Adding Mod, Germap version 1.2, Paris Rebuilt, Swedish Islands version 1.02, so not the 1.10 version you are used to from my Pro Mods Global Edition. This is the non-Pro Mods version 1.02. And then on top of that, we have the background map. And that is the entire active mods list. So there you have it. That's my first version of the global map combo for Black Sea DLC. And as promised, it's time to go through the different things you would have to consider if this combo doesn't work for you. First, you need all six map DLCs for this combo to work. If you don't have all six, the game will crash. Second, if you do have all six map DLCs and it still crashes, make sure you use the exact same map mod versions that I use and also that you obviously use the same major game version that I use, which happens to be version 1.36. The minor versions you use doesn't matter, but it's important for this combo to work that you are on version 1.36 whatever. Third, check the load order and make sure it is identical to mine. Fourth, if you have additional active mods, remove them and if that doesn't help, remove all mods to ensure your profile actually work without any of those precious additional mods before you add the mods I use only. Once the combo work, you may crash your profile by adding all your additional mods back in again. It's a problem you will have to solve, there's nothing I can do about it. If it doesn't work despite you doing everything I just said, you need to create a new profile, complete the first hole on that profile and then add just the map combo. And as a last resort, I have a Discord server, World of Wombat, where I also have a support channel where you can post your game.log file once you've followed all the instructions I just mentioned and using the game.log file uh, we will figure out what causes the crashes. And it should be needless to say, but unfortunately I have to say it anyway, don't even bother contacting me here or anywhere else regarding issues if you are using a pirated version of the game. Support SES and buy the game like everyone else. There wouldn't be a Euro Truck Simulator 2 or Black Sea DLC if everyone pirated the game. And we would possibly have had the Iberia DLC already if the pirates had bought the game instead. So uh, thanks for nothing pirates. And honestly, thank you so much to everyone else for supporting SES. Without you, I would have been forced to play, I don't know, Ultra Off-Road 2019 Alaska instead. And that's it, I'm done. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up and if you haven't already done so, subscribe as well. As always, feel free to share this and any of my videos on any of your social medias. It helps me grow, so in advance, thank you so much for that. 
Take care, everyone, and have a great weekend. Bye-bye.